By the way, this intro has been shot literally after the vlog because I kind of realized that I recorded it, recorded the intro at least in 1080p and it came out really trashy and when I edited it in post, it didn't really look as great. As usual, all the timestamps will be in the description below and you guys can swipe around the video whenever you like. And if you ask me, I feel like the best days were day two uh, day 4 and day 6 yeah 3 of those were the best so feel free to skip around and if you would like you can just watch the whole video as usual and honestly this took a lot of effort and yeah so this is kind of the biggest project that I've ever attempted where I film a little part every day for seven days and compile it to form this kind of vlog and let me know in the comments down below how you guys like it and maybe i'll do more of this maybe i won't and if you guys are liking this kind of content then a thumbs up would be great and a subscribe to me channel would be optimal along with the hit of that bell icon so that you guys can be informed and you never miss another video of mine and you're updated daily and also you can follow me on Instagram at ShashTheBachetti and yeah so let's get into the vlog I guess and hopefully you guys enjoy it enjoy. Um, as you can see, my room is pretty freaking messy and yeah, I just came back from school so I've been feeling pretty demotivated because of my results and I know for a fact that wasn't the best I could do and I'm ready to keep up the consistency for prelims and I just recently posted a video on that so you can check it out and it's going to be a mess to edit and upload so hopefully you enjoy it and if you did just like, subscribe, comment down below what parts of the video you like and so yeah just to get started with this vlog I'm probably just gonna arrange my room so let me just show you guys how my room is so this is how my room looks we've been getting some repainting done on the walls so it's pretty crap look at this iron board desk and, and there's paint everywhere I swear to god and I wanted this painting up but it completely broke down so and yeah look at this mess I promise you I'm not really this messy but due to painting and renovation I've it's just become really messy so yeah I've got the wires quite neatly arranged I think and yeah and I'm not looking forward to arranging this room and after arranging it I might do some studying and yeah and another thing the Wi-Fi is down it's annoying basically so yeah I'll get started and then I'll keep you somewhere here and enjoy the time lapse So this dude right here needs some food in his belly. I have this thing where I have to eat food first. Alright, so I had my dinner. Pretty good spicy chicken or curry with rice. And now I'm gonna go study and I haven't really managed to arrange my room properly but I guess I arranged my desk and that will have to do for now because it's getting late and I need to study. So um, I have to do a review on my biology paper and I also have to do my math paper but the Wi-Fi is on so I can't do it. So doom and group matters aside, right now I'm just gonna be reviewing my 
paper so yep all of this goes into this goodness I have my JBL here so I'm probably gonna play some music and yeah I'll see you in a few hours Honestly, the more I think about it, the more frustrated I get that our timetable has to be shifted. It really affects me a lot. Good morning. I'm basically gonna just do my grooming and brush my teeth, bathe, and then get dressed and then leave for school. And I'll probably talk to you guys on the way. This is the first time I'm picking up the camera again today. I'm a bit more awake than before. It's about 6.30 I think. So yeah. Uh, today is a pretty short day. It goes until 2 o'clock or 2.20. to go to the library and get some work done. I'm going to take you guys along with me. And at around 6.30, I have my vaccination. Uh, my second dose actually, so uh, I've been hearing scary things, but hopefully it all goes well. So yeah, today was a uh, pretty decent day actually, because bio biology lesson is a highlight of my week, and I, it was pretty funny. Uh, we're finishing up the last topic, I think, of our syllabus and physics we started on the last topic of our syllabus and yeah things are starting to heat up i guess i'm just gonna change and eat my lunch i'll see you in a while <laughs> all right so thing is i got too lazy to head out to the library so i'm just gonna do a little bit of studying and then i'll see how it goes so um, I did some procrastination and I watched the uh, I watched the latest karma medic video. I need to study now, so homework first, and then after that biology or physics or actually AMATS because my Wi-Fi is back and I need to complete the paper that I started. Okay, so I'm just gonna put you guys up here, I think. Yeah, up here, and then you guys can watch me study. Strangely, I am pretty excited about the benefits that might come to it. I've been hearing 
rumors that we might not even have to do a quarantine if we travel overseas. So I'm really excited about that. So continuing it, hey. Uh, so after I get vaccinated, I'm just gonna draw some money and get a nice haircut and after that, we'll see how it goes. So if you guys uh, live in Singapore, then you know the past few days have been quite depressing actually. The weather's just been continuous monsoons and everything. So it's been pretty tough, but... And especially on actually uh, last week, wait, this week, Monday was torturous. My shoes got broken, it got flimsy, my socks were wet. And the whole day, there was a this strong wind blowing. And it was so annoying to actually bear. And I was in lessons and I was feeling cold and I didn't have my jacket. So it was really, really difficult. Alright guys, so your boys just got them vaccine things. So I just had my second dose. And it went pretty well. I just... Uh, the 30 minutes waiting time was a bit boring, couldn't really hit record on anything. But it was pretty fun overall. I mean, I definitely felt the jab more this time, but nothing I can do about that. I guess I just felt a little bit more tense. And it was like, uh, I felt a lot. I, I felt that my muscles were more tense. And it was almost as if like, that tenseness in the muscles actually made it harder for the needle to go in. I don't really feel anything yet. Maybe I'll get some arm soreness later. I've heard scary things though. My friends have gotten a high fever chills. But hopefully, touch wood, I don't get any of that. The first dose had nothing. So hopefully the second dose doesn't have anything. So um, after that, now I'm just going to get a haircut at my favourite barber shop. And planning to do an undercut. And yeah. I'll meet you after I get it done. Alright guys, I asked for an undercut. This is what I got. I'm not, it's not too shabby. I mean, what not really fulfill my expectations. But still, awesome haircut. I can actually feel the wind in my hair right now. So yeah, I'm pretty comfortable now. And my phone is out of bed, almost. It's like 1%, hopefully it's still recording. If not, uh... Okay, so... Um, now I'm just gonna go back home, eat dinner. So, um, right now I'm gonna have a Discord call with the boys and we're gonna study until 11, I think. And after that, sleep and then I'll get back to you. So, yeah. Uh, okay, give me a second. Hi. Hey, yo, say hi to the vlog. Wait, what? Yeah, say hi. Hi. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna set you guys back in the place I always say you can basically see a time lapse of me So, I'll see you better now the second dose after effects are kind of wearing off now touch wood so um, yeah and it's pretty bright so I'm looking forward to going to the library and yeah all right guys so the weekend has begun and you just realize I'm not facing the sun I'm sitting down and talking to the camera like this so this I want to tell you guys about my experience for the past five videos or six videos 
I feel like the first video I was super nervous and I didn't I couldn't form my words properly. But as we neared this video, it I kind of it kind of became pretty natural for me to talk to the camera like this. And it feels like I'm actually talking to a normal person. And obviously I don't talk to a normal person like this. I have my accent and my behavior and everything. But the thing is it's better to look more eloquent on camera. So that's how I'm approaching this. And another disclaimer is that Obviously, if you're filming anything, you're obviously gonna just show the best parts of your life and not the worst parts. So, whatever you, whatever you do, you never, never can judge a person based on his online appearance because such things are really biased. And even though I may seem super productive some days or very less productive a few other days, that really isn't the whole story. And there's much more to it than meets the eye. So, yeah. to one of my most favorite places in Singapore which is Drong Regional Library I love studying there so I'll speak to you guys so I'm thinking of doing at least like two hours of studying there and I need to get some clothes so I'll just see you there Alright guys, I'm not sure if you can hear me but I don't think I'm going to be recording much in the library because I don't think 